Hey guys, I uh, hope you guys are doing great. Um, we're, it is uh, Wednesday, uh, right before the storm. Yeah, we have a, not a storm, we have a Hurricane Milton coming our way. Right now, I am at the hotel where my wife works. I'm, I'm shooking my house from here, just shaking the live feed of what's happening back home. But like you can see, the hurricane is gonna come straight to us. Uh, again, I'm at the hotel with my wife. Uh, she's a manager here, so during a hurricane, she has to be on site. Um, it is around, let's see, what time is it? Um, two o'clock in the afternoon. We expect something in the next couple hours, the weather to just get worse. Um, but uh, other than that, I'm uh, gonna try to record and give you some feedback from Florida, Tampa Bay. And also after the storm come down, I'm gonna drive to where my boat is at the storage in Anklo Key. Hey guys, uh, 5.30 in the afternoon. Uh, we have a couple bands coming. You know, it's blowing a little bit that much. Uh, thank God. I don't want to say thank God because somebody else is getting hit, but uh, the hurricane just moved uh, south from us. Um, at least the eye. We can still get some uh, some winds and rain, but not as bad as we were expecting. So thank God for that. Uh, let's hope that things stay the same and everybody's safe. I think the worst is just happening now and we lost power um, yeah this is not good Got the emergency lights on. Wanna make sure everybody's okay. Fourth floor, the ice machine room is leaking very bad through the AC and the wall. That's right. Yeah. So uh, that you cannot see much. Um, I see some trees already in the ground, but uh, everything is fine. I just uh, have to go floor by floor, make sure everybody's doing okay. Because the alarm, the fire alarm is going off. E 
every time it goes off, I have to go to the room and disconnect it. But everything's fine, I think it's passing by now. Let's see this other room over here. This is the second floor. We have 50 people, I think, 60, 50 people. We lost power about an hour ago. This is uh, the fourth floor, the highest floor. <coughs> Water's, uh, oh, nice. I'm not sure if you guys can see it, but it's leaking through the air condition here. It's not much now, it's just more wind, but before it was a lot. That's the elevator. Jesus, the building is shaking. Bendición, todo bien, gracias a Dios hasta ahora. Está aquí caminando en el parking. Se fue el viento. Ay, hay una ramota ahí en el piso. Te enseño ahora, pero. This is uh, una de las abejas que se cayó. Esta es la entrada de atrás. Um, vamos a ver. Hay más ramas ahí de la verja. Uh, se cayó eso ahí. Nada esos carros aquí. No sé dónde vino esa rama, pero es grande. Eh, Dios quiera que no le haya roto ningún carro a nadie. Ah, no, y parece que se libraron de cantazos del carro. De, me tiraste una cyber truck aquí. Las palmas están de lado. Mira las palmas. No quiero lumbar para allá porque ahí está el hotel. Eh, y no quiero que que se vea eh, el reflejo en la están durmiendo la gente son todavía estamos bien gracias a Dios es lo más importante las palmas vira pero lo demás gracias a Dios muy bien nos mantengo al tanto cuando vaya para casa especialmente que es donde me tienen preocupado eso un poco los amo Closer to the house, make sure that everything's fine. So far, so good. 
lot of debris on the ground. Um, just hoping for the best as soon as I get home. to my wife. The rose is closed, 579 is closed, so I have to go all the way back again. Everything is closed over here. That road is blocked with a tree. This other one is blocked with a tree. So the only exit we have is I-4 right now. The inter I'm sorry, I-75. Um, yeah, there's a lot of trees down. Hey guys, it's the uh, first night or second night after Hurricane Hurricane it was last night. Still here at the hotel, went back home and obviously I had some damages. Uh, like you will see right now, the fence uh, on the house. The house was fine, but things that we can replace. Good morning, buddy. How you doing, sir? And uh, yeah, we're still here at the hotel. Just making sure everybody's okay. The wife is here, so I'm with her. Looks like there's a big line for cars uh, over there. I don't know if you can see it. Uh, the gas station, that's a uh, uh, Flying J. Um, the TA doesn't have no gas yet. Um, so the line is huge, like you can imagine. People waiting on hours to get some fuel. I still have about a half tank or so on my car, on my truck, since I did a couple of trips back and forth um, home. Um, but yeah, uh, just uh, again trying to help the wives, trying to make sure the guests are fine. Um, still, again, have no power to who knows when. When I took the road uh, today to uh, to the house to take a look at it, I found a couple people stranded that I was able to help. Um, and then tomorrow, hopefully, we're going to go and see the boat, see what shape it is right now. So... Chicken or fair though. Guys, I don't know what is war size. Uh, before the storm or after the storm. Um, I went to a Publix. Uh, that's the food market over here. And uh, it was open. Um, 
<laughs> there was not much really to grab from the shelves. Uh, just to grab the chicken, the, the, uh, the roasted chicken already, there were maybe 40 people in line waiting for their chicken to be roasted and finished. Um, now I'm just driving back to the hotel where my wife is, uh, bringing some uh, hot dogs, burgers, and stuff like that just uh, for the employees. Um, and uh, yeah, it's just fighting the traffic. I think there's about maybe 300 cars just waiting to get fuel. Um, so we just have to go with the flow. So stay tuned. This is the line in the traffic just for the fuel right here. See cars coming from the other end, cars coming from the back end. They have two lines, it's insane. This is the line now for the TA gas station. It goes all the way to the back, turns around and goes back to the TA back there. So here I am on line uh, waiting for uh, this line right here to get shorter and shorter until it's my turn to fill up my truck. Right now I have about half the tank of fuel. I just want to fill it up, make sure that I'm maxed out for the week. Um, since I have to travel uh, on Monday, I have to go to the airport. So, yeah, again, uh, this is something very common. I've been waiting here because I only have uh, literally uh, maybe 14 cars in front of me. I've seen some other gas stations uh, that had, uh, I'm not exaggerating what I say, 200, maybe 300 people waiting online. The Flying J and the TA uh, travel gas stations, they had about 200 cars. I mean, it was insane. This over here, only 14 cars. I can wait, fill it up, and be ready for the week. But that's the, usually the problems with these storms. It's not really this, the hurricane, of course, you have consequences, right? You have damage and stuff like that. But it's really more the aftermath. So uh, let's see what happens. Right here, you guys can see the command center. This is where uh, they're setting up all the rescue missions um, for Pasco County. Everything is empty. <coughs> Everything is empty. Oh, 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 oh,